Well, good morning, buddy. I'm back out at it again today. Today I come back to my old farm permission, the one where I found that one ounce copper round <laughs> that I thought was silver. But anyways, I come back up here again today. I've got a lot of land left up here to hunt. You can see I've got the 11 inch coil on today. This guy's got actually owns over 200 acres, but you know a lot of it's not gonna have much on it. So I brought the bigger coil to see if I couldn't cover a little more ground a little quicker on the spot that doesn't have anything. But anyways, let's get started up here again, see if we can find anything interesting, and I'll get back with you. Well, the first target that doesn't sound like iron. 31, 32, 33. That sounds really good. It's definitely going to be deeper. There it lays. <laughs> going to be a silver quarter 1954 Washington that's yeah, pretty good for the first good target of the day I've dug some iron but mainly nails and fence staples sweet got us a silver quarter let's keep looking I got another one here, coming up in iron, just like a nail, four, five, six. Well, I believe this is something. I really like, it ain't gonna be a nail. It's gonna be a skeleton key. <laughs> awesome. That's a cool find. I think that's only like the fourth one I've ever found. Let's keep going. Well, I got another one here that sounds pretty good. It's jumping in and out of iron. Turn the iron off. 26, 27, 28. Let's see if we can find it down there. Good weed down there. Check it out. Laying there in the sand. Looks like a 1951 Rosie. Got us another silver. Let's keep looking. Fifteen, sixteen. Not real deep on that one. Shotgun shield head stamp. Nitro club on that one. Let's keep going. A 
No solid 17. Not real deep. Might be another shotgun shell head stamp. But let's see. Not a shotgun shell head stamp. Looks like a clock gear. Probably made out of copper. On to the next. Twenty six, seven, eight, nine. Let's see what that one is. A uh, penny? A uh, weedy. Got a wheat scent. Looks like that one's gonna be a 50 something also. I believe that's a 51. Same as that rosy was. Let's keep looking. I finally got on another good sounding one. Twenty-six to thirty. Gonna be deeper. That way a little bit. Still over that way. We got it that time. Oh, it's going to be a mercury dime this time. I can't see the date on that one. Definitely a mercury dime. <laughs> awesome. Let's keep looking. Twenty six, twenty seven, up to thirty two. Maybe a little deeper. Let's see what it is. That's it. Just a big old brass nut off of something. <laughs> I got another one here. 26, 27, 28. I went and worked around the yard a little bit. 
a lot of clad up there. Let's see what this one is. Now oh, we got a wheat scent. I can't quite tell what the date is on that one. It's definitely a weedy. We'll get the dirt off of it a little bit. We can go a little bit longer. Hey everybody, we're going to do a wrap up for today's hunt. Like I said earlier in the video, I went back out to my old farm permission. And you can see what I found today. All this stuff up here, stuff you normally find on an old farm. Just rusty old nails and big old rusty bolt. Other bolts and washers and big old brass nut off something. Just garbage. Got a little bit of clad. Cause I got most of clad up around the house. I'm sure there's some older coins up there, but there's still a lot of clad around the house right now. I got two dollars and quarters, two nickels, two, four, six, eight, nine dimes, and a few pennies. I got this copper gear here. I'm pretty sure that's out of an old clock. Got a shotgun shell head stamp. I'll get a date on that one. You got me another skeleton key. It's been a long time since I found one of those. I got me three or five old coins today. I got a 1951 weedy, 1952 weedy. 1951 Roosevelt dime, a 1945 Mercury dime, and a 1954 Washington quarter. Didn't mind getting three silvers out of there today. Anyways, it was a fun hunt. Anyways, I hope you all enjoyed the hunt. As always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you at the next.